Hello guys, Dr. Oxo here with another cool little tip for you on how to build. And this really isn't a tip, this is more so just a quality of life help thing for you. So if you're playing on the PlayStation 4 version, the Xbox One version, or you're just playing PC and don't like to use the debug console and remember commands or anything like that, this is a easy way, at least on level terrain, because it can still be a bit finicky on uneven ground to get them to line up quite like this, but this is an easy way to get any of your walls to look like this. So what you want to do is you see how these walls, they're all placed on the point where they would want to connect to each other. If I go like this, you see instantly they're going to want to snap to one another. What you want to do is, now see if I was trying to move this wall, I would want to place this wall down first, obviously. Then I would start by placing this wall down. And I would place it down outside of where I wanted to build it. And then I would walk up to the wall on the side, look towards the very end of it, and grab it by the very end of the actual wall. And what, what happens is, because I think the actual snapping mechanic is gated to your field of view, or something like that, because what I noticed is if I grabbed it by the nose like this, and then sort of moved it around... You, you, you notice I'm not getting the snapping that was happening when I was looking at it from a different angle. So by doing that, you can see that you can move these pieces. And I know it's confusing in red. I, I should probably have not had my, my thing in red. But basically, hold on. I'm trying to get the, the best position. There we go. Because see, the bright red is when I can actually place it in red mode. It's a little bit weird, but... See, like, I could place it here. And see, at this angle, it's the same angle. So if I wanted to deepen that angle, I could turn like this. And put the gate at a little bit of a deeper angle. But you see, it's not quite un uneven. So what I'd have to do is grab this, move to the right a bit, and then pull it in. You see? Evens that wall out just a little bit. And then I can put some more in. Just as, as long, just as long as I keep that snapping part out of my field of view, it won't be my problem. So if I want to bring the wall back to the position that I had it at before, it's a really specific angle you have to grab it at. I think that's around where I had it. Oh, no, I got to come this way with it more. Or to the right with it more. A little bit more. And back. A little bit more and more. Oh, too much. Ooh. That's close, but I have it at a really weird angle. It's all about grabbing it at that right angle. It's going to take you a little bit to get that angle first, but once you get it, you'll be able to make almost seamless walls. Because you see, if I grab it here, it's going to snap every time. It's all about grabbing it at that right angle that the nose doesn't want to snap out of your field of view. In there, that's pretty darn close. There's still a little gap in between it, and I'll finagle it after this video. But anyways, thank you for watching. And I hope this helps you build.